an immersive action RPG that takes you on an exhilarating journey between life, death, love, and sacrifices. New Eden is full of occult dangers, and not every wandering soul is willing to cooperate. Play as both characters, combining Red's weaponry with Antaea's supernatural powers. A mix of combat styles are available, thanks to Red's rifle, sword, and firebane. Alongside Antea's ethereal attacks, unleash devastating spiritual abilities from teleportation to spectral damage zones. Upgrade your arsenal. Time for me to shine. I'm going to need a hand here. As you face increasingly malicious foes. Essence remains upon it. For now, it will do me. Progress in the skill tree, empowering your abilities and talents, granting our couple another measure of power. Antea's abilities extend beyond combat, giving her the possibility to navigate New Eden with greater ease. Enhance her spiritual perception to reach higher areas with her spectral leap. Revisiting places you've already been to can reveal new areas and uncover hidden secrets. Dive into an immersive action RPG, becoming a beacon of hope in a world consumed by darkness. How much will you compromise your ghost hunting vow for the sake of love? You assume the roles of two banishers, a couple who are experienced spirit hunters, entrusted with the daunting task of lifting a malevolent and ominous curse. I know you're here. Antea is highly skilled in control and self-assured. She has demonstrated her worth, Peace on your soul. while Red carries guilt and self-doubt and serves as both her devoted partner and apprentice. Wait, wait for what? We're banishers. Their profound love binds them together, with a shared conviction that the realms of the living and the departed should remain distinct. But after an ill-advised attack, Antea is killed, leaving her lover in solitude and profound despair. Unable to move on to the next plane of existence, she returns to Red as the thing she despises most, a ghost. Torn between their vows to protect the living from malicious spirits and the nightmare of Antea's condition, they wander the eerie wilderness of North America, seeking to liberate her from her new plight, whatever the price to pay. While the Banishers adhere to the mantra of life to the living, death to the dead, your own affliction may lead you down a darker path when you find yourself confronted with the daunting choice of sacrificing the living to sustain the love of your life with their souls. Guilt taints not only the lives of others, but also your very own. How far will you go to save Antea? You embark on a powerful adventure where love and grief shape your story. We made an agreement. Are you having second thoughts? Explore the beautiful lands of New Eden, trapped between the realms of the living and the dead. Banishes to the end. Uncover secrets, navigate mysterious landscapes, and meet memorable but tormented characters whose fate rests in your hands. Who are you? Why do you follow me? Each one of them has their own story and a profound personality. He's lost his hand. You are nothing. I'm a 
monster. Needing a thorough understanding of their motivations before taking any decisions. You can't come in. Ah! Back to your monster! Your choices carry substantial consequences that must be taken seriously. Come no closer! But who shall judge you, Banisher, when judgment time has come? As they face life or death situations, will you hold them responsible? You are no more! Even if it means sacrificing their lives for their actions. Will you banish the souls of the departed? I banish! Condemning them to suffer in the void, consumed by torment? Or will you choose to elevate these souls? Go in peace. Freeing them from eternal sorrow, granting them serenity. If this Doolin fellow was meant to protect the missing group, I dread to think what became of them. This is Thickskin's doing. These people were defenseless. She lied to keep them safe. She gambled. They lost. She let with her head, not her heart. I won't condemn her for that. Someone was here, some time ago. Take heart indeed. Maybe they're still out there somewhere. Maybe. Papers, half bond. Says here that Kate loved a woman named Deborah. And let her die. Younger New Smith has a low opinion of herself. She'd have to keep her love well hidden. There were more than a few settlers. This scourge is going to be huge. Are you ready for the ritual? No, but let's do it anyway. It's a scourge, all right. Anger shaped to kill. We wish you no harm. We know all about the wolf whistles. The whistles thick skin gave you. Oh, shit! Yeah! <laughs> 
Ich bitte ihr. Not that skin. Kate. It spoke her name with just one voice. Thick skin and Kate both accused. Is anyone in these down woods innocent? Then it were real. This beast. How did I miss you on my travels through the woods? Because it did not want you. It wants your sister. You gave them the whistles. You sent them to die. Those with metal would have reached camp and had to use them too. Those who died won't need feeding. The weak die that the strong may live. You tricked them. I tested them. This be the way of it. This be the way of the world. We have a hidden watcher. The sister. Kate? Show yourself. What? You're unarmed! Get yourself back to camp! All these long years, I wish to be like you. <laughs> to be as tough as you. If I was stalwart like my sister, I thought. I'd have saved her. I was just like you. Cold, selfish, a fear of my own heart. And the woman I love died for it. Everything I did, I did so that you... I dare because I care. Enough! Look about you. You brought this curse upon yourselves. Falls to me to lift it. Maybe they're not ready. Broken hearts need time to heal. If ever they heal. Mumble all you want, I regret nothing. The curse struck, and I alone saw the danger. I acted. And now it is I who must act. Evil spirit. I... What about the missing group of refugees? What about them? Kate told me they went missing before reaching your camp. Any chance they survived in the woods? Not the slightest. Otherwise they would already be here. Those poor bastards are long dead. Speak frankly. What would you have me do? Banish a ghost that doesn't exist. The beast is nothing much. A bear, perhaps a wolf. I'll hunt your beast. Whatever it is. In the wild, we carry muskets. And we carry these. Whistle for help if the need be great. And the gun? My sister can spare her musket. If you can get it from her. Kate will be hurt. I predict fireworks. You think Kate's feelings get in her way? Watch her reaction when you ask for the musket, then tell me I'm wrong. Don't you have business elsewhere? Go. Save us all from the beast. Go do my sister's char work. I need a musket. Thick skin said I should have yours. You'll rot in hell first. You and your sister don't much like each other, do you? No, we love each other. And everyone here owes her their lives. But... Uh... Thick skin measures worth by metal. The strong will live and the weak will die. She chose you to hunt the beast with my musket. She doesn't have to say a word about what she thinks of me.
The more I know Thick Skin, the more I like her. Some would call her ruthless. But is she wrong? Aye, she's wrong. We survive when we care for each other. There's honor in that. If this keeps up, there won't be a wolf left in New England. It forced its way through here, dug up all the wolves, and plucked them out. Not even the younglings survived. What could have done this? Vengeance. Vengeance incarnate. Whatever butchered the wolves spoke as one with many voices. Many spirits in borrowed flesh. Could it be a scourge? Yes, a scourge. Powerful and very angry. What the bloody hell? Let's make this quick. You're no. That was a little closer than I would have liked. That howl, like many souls screaming as one. <laughs> Fancy that, a body, and there are teeth marks. He's not that way to get in his way, is he? Why do I get the feeling that we're sitting ducks? Careful. Don't just stand there. Move! You're in its sights, Ray. You're done. Can't move it. to the living, we say, and death to the dead. It is not so simple. Since the dawn of humanity, the dead have lingered. Dead as alive, we are complex and emotional beings. Many entangled are the ties that bind. Since the beginning of memory, banishers have fought to sever those ties. Death is but a trifle. It comes to us all, to haunt or be haunted. There lies the true horror. I, Charles Davenport, should know it. The haunting of New Eden scared me to death. I dearly wish I had not begged my friends to come and lift the curse.
So, you're a banisher, eh? You want ghosts, right? <laughs> you must have seen some strange things. We had our share. Yes. But I've never seen a ghost myself. But they are real, right? So what? You track and kill him? Is that it? It takes a brave man to walk these wilds alone. We are banishers. We end suffering for those who live. We bring closure to those who don't. think you have more time and suddenly you don't.